That's, we're, we're, what are we at, like 15 minutes on this lesson, Matt? 15 minutes, baby. 15 minutes, we're getting stock shots. Five iron golf. Make it a thing. I'm Eddie. Where, where am I? What are you seeing? It's not a golf course. This, we're inside. Today we got something a little bit special. Today we are down in Chicago. We are at currently the largest five iron golf facility in the whole network of five iron golf. We are at Five Iron Chicago. We are here to do a lesson. I am your average mid handicap golfer. I'm always looking to get better. So today we came down to the city. We left the cornfields. We left all of that. We're coming down to Chicago. We're gonna go get ourselves a lesson. We're gonna go get ourselves right. So that way we start getting better scores. We start having lower numbers out there on the golf course while we come inside for a little bite to eat. It's gonna be a great episode of main course, guys. It's main course, well, it's not a food edition. It's main course lesson edition. Let's go. As you see, it's main course, but it's not food edition, it's lesson edition. So I'm down here in Chicago with Matt. Matt, are you the main pro down here? Are you one of the pros? Yep, I'm the director of golf here at Five Iron Chicago. Director of golf. This is this is the guy when you want to stop shanking it over there, little slap hooking it over there, you come talk to Matt. So Matt, from my game, Mid handicapper, I'm, I'm around a 14 handicap. Yep. Some days I'm drawing the ball a little bit right to left. Some days it's a little bit of a fade. Some days it's straight on the money. Yep. So I want to get better. Well, should we do a swing evaluation? Or are we going to do kind of you know see where I'm at? And what's the most things to improve on? Is there any special shots you can teach me to kind of make my game better? What, what are we going to do to make the most of today's visit? You know, next level. I think we're going to do all of the above, right? We're going to okay. cover everything, right? So we're going to do a little swing evaluation. Part of that is asking about you first, right? Okay. See what injuries you have, see if any have any that you're compensating for in the golf swing. Yep. Then we'll work on some shots that we can hit, right? Specific shot patterns, draws, fades, low, high, all that good stuff. And then we'll work on a little specialty shot here at the end. A uh, uh, special, that's a teaser, guys. It's oh, the yeah. business, that's a teaser specialty shot. I don't know what it's gonna be. It's gonna be a Matt Wait special. And Wait and see. So my biggest thing is I just wanna have a consistent shot. I don't need to have every tr trick of the trade. I just wanna make sure that every shot that I hit, I can plan for it. So we're gonna get working on that today. Sure. Guys, it's gonna be a great episode here with Matt down at Five Iron in Chicago. It's gonna be a good one, let's go. So what are we doing right now at the alignment sticks, Matt? Right now we're laying these alignment sticks down. So the one here on the, uh, right in front of you, that's gonna be just general foot body alignment. Aiming up straight towards the screen there. And then here, this stick right here, this is gonna be an exaggerated path, right? So we're gonna try and hit these draw patterns here for a second. And really the way we do that again is having this club go out to the right and create that draw pattern, right? We suck it left, it's gonna create a cut. We throw that club out to the right, it's gonna create more of a draw pattern, right? And playing around with these things is how we get better, right? We practice them to get better on the golf course. And I'm not an overly technical guy here, so we're just gonna hit some shapes and see how it goes for us. Okay. I feel like that one's gonna be very right. A little pushy there. Yeah, I left the face open. Felt like it. Yep. Yep. Four right. Right. So there's that big miss you want to be aware of on the golf course. So big miss is never really the direction you're swinging. It's always the face. So my face was right. exaggerated here. You guys at home, I should have been hitting it square, and I'm way, way over there. Way over there. Yes, so even though I want to hit it to right field, using the baseball analogy. Right. I just hit that thing six rows deep on the down the foul line. Yep. Let's, let's try and exaggerate the field here, right? So okay. I want you to start this club right, or this ball right. I'll just put this up here for you. A little challenge, right? Okay. Golf's hard, so we're gonna try some hard drills and get better at it, right? So we're gonna hit the ball right at that noodle, but we're gonna have the ball curve left. So I want you to hit a big old hook for me. Hit just right in the noodle. Let's see if it turns around for us. And there it is. All right, and we're just gonna take the club straight forward here and focus on just letting the club release. There you go, right? So your tendency is, yeah, you like to have the hands under release a little bit, keep that face open. That's mm -hmm. where the push is coming from. You just gotta loosen these babies up 
Let them roll over there. Right? And you're not really gonna do that in your swing. We're over exaggerating. Over exaggerating. Try to get that. Felt a little bit better. Let's see. Uh -huh. Let's see what it said. There it is. Right back to the center line. Like we hear all the time when you're trying to make any type of swing change, any type of correction, right. it feels uncomfortable. Yep. Like I, when you say an exaggerate that 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 a, that hit, like it feels uncomfortable. It feels like thing. I'm gonna do that exaggerated hook that you just saw. Yep. Exactly. To hit a hit a different shape, we have to exaggerate these things. It has to feel a little right. uncomfortable. Make changes. Well, let's. You're on the right track, buddy. We're, did you hear that? We're getting there. Right track. We're getting there. Speak nice. right, so what so. we did there was we were very we over exaggerated this move. Okay, so we're throwing this club out to the right using the path number, and by having you over exaggerate it, you tend to leave the face open a little bit, hit a little bit of a push. So now we got that face a lot more square, right? Point three measuring degrees. I call that square all day, and then we got that shot pattern to line up back on the line, just ten feet left of our target. Button for birdie. You heard that. That's a birdie putt. With me, with my two putts, you know, two putts all day. I'll take two putts all day when you hit a green in regulation, but that's, that's lower numbers, guys. All right, guys, that is it for my lesson here at Five Iron Golf with Matt. Sir. Got my drills to work on. Gonna get improve those fades and those draws. Again, we're not gonna fix it in one day. It's, it's not a one day fix. Nope. It's an ongoing practice Marathon. thing. Matt, thank you so much for your time today. My pleasure. Awesome lesson. It's actually my first lesson I've ever had, so Matt, fantastic teacher. If you guys are interested in having a lesson at Five Iron Golf, the number's right, right here. In a, maybe, it, maybe, maybe we'll put it up here, a little graphic right there. I don't, I don't, <laughs> I don't know, editing's gonna take care of it. Yes, sir. Uh, Matt, what, what's the best time for lessons? I'm here every day of the week, every day of the week, seven days a week. We're open from eight in the morning to eight at night. Uh, so come see me whenever they're open during those hours. I'm here just about every day. Perfect, and then uh, rates for a lesson? Rates, individual adults are 140 an hour. Uh, the kids are 110. Uh, we do uh, group rates as well for about 190 for two to three people that can come in here. Use this whole space we have back here, two sins and everything, so it's a good value add. Perfect. As well. So you get a couple of your buddies. You guys all have something to work on. You get a nice group lesson. Work on work on a little stinger lesson with Matt. You got it. Work on everyone hitting consistent draws. Split the split the cost. You can't go wrong with that. Hopefully you guys enjoyed watching this episode of Main Course uh, Lesson Edition. Thank you guys for watching. As always, have a good one.